Welcome back to an episode of We Stand on Fort Alazar and have a beautiful view around the landscape. It's just amazing. And we're still unable to pick up that little torch in order to make our way through the darkness a bit more visual. Oh, look at that. Let's get, just, get, just take that in that view. That is amazing. How did you usually... Wait a minute. That is just absolutely cool. What was the... I don't want to use the zoom in button for now, but... Oh, that is so cool. Okay, wait. Could we get maybe a nice other angle here? Like that one? Or maybe we just take that. Yeah, look at that. But no. Praise the sun. Wait a minute. Praise the sun. That is the... um. Do we even have a, an animation like that? I mean, we could cheer. Uh, what's the other one? Uh, praise, praise, praise. Something with the hands up. We could bow. Eyes on you. Whatever. Oh, interesting. So there are locked emotes. How do you get that one? Uh, this item is an account-wide item. Able to use on any other... Ah... Comes with the prime stuff. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So do you unlock it uh, once you get prime, and then it disappears again once you don't have that anymore? Or how does that actually work, right? How does that work? Can you own it once and then forever, or do you have to constantly activate that? <laughs> <laughs> because stuff like this uh, needs to be known, right? So weird. Whatever. Um, we wanted to continue with the main mission, and Jonas Alazar will provide. Whoever he was, when you knew him, he's changed into something else now. He certainly commands many corrupted and wields the power of the Tempest. Hmm. And he's calling you out by name. Indeed. Now, uh, what were the other Soul Wardens like, actually? Let's just get some more background. Complex, brave, frustrating, wonderful. I remember Ezra and his clever toys, Lilith and her lovely voice, Pravin with his practical jokes. What I hmm. wouldn't give to hear them laugh again. Aww. And do we know where he, Thorpe, is? Really? In Restless Shore. I've been dispatching most new wardens to hold the lines in Great Cleave and Shadow Mountain, but I have sent some of our best scouts to look for weaknesses in Thorpe's base. Now then, that's where I'm going. Well, but... what? Not only is it an insane risk, but what about the parley? You convinced all the factions to sit down together, and now you would just vanish before negotiations even begin? Well, the parley is about the factions, not because of me, right? Come on. Begin the parley without me. I'll be back before you know it. Well, promises, right? Promises. Hurry back, will you? Who knows how long I'll be able to keep the factions from each other's throats without you? Uh, grrr, as Euripides said, talk sense to a fool and he calls you foolish. Fine, I'll arrange the parlay while you are in Restless Shore. Do not get yourself killed or corrupted. Killed, maybe. Hopefully not, because I don't like to repair my stuff. <laughs> it's getting too expensive. Well, actually, I shouldn't uh, even... What is Gilded Grease? This one? This one, what? Uh, boss farm, artifacts, bears... Uh, lucky Warhammer in game. I want to look at that. Strength. Lucky for. Mm. You have some chance of rare items and stuff from monsters. Then we have some shock and some more luck. Look at that. Chance of the rare item from chess and monsters. This one. Go to Greece is a great hammer. Sure. This is what hammers usually are. Great. Hammers. And uh, we are going to change uh, our areas again to go to Restless Shore. We should have just followed the directions to begin with. It goes uh, obviously onto the call right here. Huh. Is this where Thorpe is? Wait a minute. Yeah, the depths is where Thorpe is. Yeah, I do really have to do this now. 
Do I? Uh, fast travel, yeah. Fast travel only works if I am... Um... But no, wait a minute. We do have a settlement there. I don't need to think about it too much. I could just use this thing. And cheapen my ace of traveling cost a little bit. Uh, looking for heal and tank for dynasty. Every warhammer is a hammer, but not every hammer is a warhammer. Mm -hmm. Exactly what I said. <laughs> Everybody here in equipment. Um. Wait a minute. Uh, uh, not free war. Hammer uh, is worth 40k. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, damn it. I can't chat anymore. You gotta be kidding me. Uh, why? Uh, what's going on? Okay. So I can try it in, uh, in area mode. I can't do this right now. Interesting. Really interesting. Is there a certain... Is there a restriction again? Uh, the scrolling dine doesn't seem to be hindered in any form. Uh, so we should be alright. Now I can chat in recruitment. Uh, let, let's try this. Uh, not every warhammer is worth 40k. Where, uh, the, there we go. You gotta be kidding me, I can't use recruitment. Why not? What's going on? What kind of restriction is that? Why is that working? Why is that just not working? Unbelievable. All right. Like you, uh, what you have to do is you have to kind of log out and log in again in order to make that work. Something is wrong with the recruitment shit. I don't know what's going on there. So, uh, where do I need to go? Talk to Warden Scout Titus. Warden Scout Titus. I definitely need to check the uh, the area there, and there I think was no titans to begin with. Oh, by the way, what about my? Uh, yeah, that one is going to get uh, a little bit more filled by the minute. Wait, what was that? Furniture. Oh, short barrel countertop. Only makes sense if you have a house, and I still haven't done that yet. What about that one? Pattern, Windows Warhammer. <laughs> how? Just how? This is so, this is so ridiculous. I have a bit too much stuff in there. Um. Okay. Let's just look at the weight and how it is distributed. A little bit of alchemical regions have to be thrown out. I don't know about the reeds, to be honest, I just want to sell them or use them or whatever. Yes, uh, protective regions, sure. Um, but let's not do any crafting right now. Let's not uh, forget why we are here. We are here to get into the depths. And maybe this is similar to the Umbrin quest. Um, so you have to go there, do this, and get yourself some parts in order to get that ace of stuff going. What about these guys? Plexus, Rio, whatnot. Maybe they are part of the depths and whatnot. Uh, wait a minute. I am in feed mode. Yeah, so I should know when I'm talking about things. And bam. Uh, oh, no, we're going for that. Should I help them out? Actually, I have the ASOF stuff, don't I? Yeah. Let's get a little bit of uh, benefit from that. Get the presence there, too. 
Let's hope I'm quick enough so I can also get some loot. Because you don't get anything if you aren't that hopeful. Ish. Alright. Come on, 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 come on. I think they already did it, right? Did they do it? Did they do it? No! They already solved it. Bollocks. No contribution, no anything. Ah! Damn it. Did you get that one going? Um, are they going for the next one or where are they going? They could. How do they even get up there? There we go. Or are they just hunting this other dude down? Nah. What's happening here? Counts as a decent enough contribution, by the way. So, next wave. Oh, this is not even the big one. Actually, deal decent damage. Ooh. The only thing is this, uh, like, Merton dude needs to stand down a little bit uh, when it comes to receiving too much damage. Because I can't heal him, he's in PvP mode. Whoa, no, let's not stand in the slicer. Actually, only slightly stand in the slicer. Hey, did I did it did I get anything? Did I get anything? Yes, I get I did. Very small amount of coin. Let's go for the big one. Wait, they also have a bunny icon. What's going on? I'm the dude with the bunny icon. <laughs> Jesus, what are they doing? He's not getting attacked because he's high level. You gotta be kidding me. Ooh, she even got the sentry. I don't know what that Where are they going? Uh, that was the large one. Yeah, let's just leave them bay. Maybe they're just going to a completely different location now. I mean, they went this way. Oh, they might have just gone to Boar's Hall. Or maybe there's a certain uh, grind run that they try to do. 
I go from one area to the next. Anyhow, I am here to go down there. Also, uh, some water modes. Let's collect them. And some nice resources of money. Right. That was number one. Well, what's this with stamina? What was going on? I was moving sideways only a little bit and then it flickered about it like mad. Boom. And another one. Boom. And another one. Boom. <sighs> Back to killing alligators, it seems. Ooh. And got it. Wait, what's that one? Flint. Hmm. <laughs> Wait. Nah, these are not player cams. Was kind of suspiciously looking. Right. Alright, alright, alright. Someone else must have cut down an awful lot of trees around here. Oh, yes, his up. And there was the sound of money coming in, or something. Ah, uh, 7,200. What on earth is happening? Uh, unbelievable. That is just ridiculous. that one uh nah that one has been taken but that one not so much i do see one in ah now there's somewhat peaceful creature walking about okay this is one uh there's number two on the other side yes oh no come on stop throwing shit can i just move about a little bit uh uninterrupted I am peaceful. I'm just wielding forces of nature. <sighs> that would be an interesting character or like combat situation. Fighting against the flood. Like not flood as in Halo flood, but flood as in an avalanche of water, basically. Or an avalanche itself, that would be pretty sweet. You, you stand right next to a mountain and then you have an ability to call down in avalanche, just like that. That would be sweet. Some really epic stuff. Like there's, um, there are games like Battlefront or uh, some similar ones. Where if you have a certain kill kind of, if you play fairly decent, then you can unlock special, uh, special characters. Like let's say Darth Vader or something like that. Maybe it was in Lord of the Rings, there was also something similar like that. Uh, then you can play as one of the main characters. That, that was really cool, actually. Like playing as Gandalf or playing as... Uh, who was the other one? Uh, the Balrog, sometimes you can even unlock this one. But let's just not play as the characters. What if you ha can unlock epic skills, right? 
if you play really well and then you play right next to a mountain then you can control the whole thing that would be really sweet anyway um or maybe something more technical like you play in a uh kind of a technological whatever environment and then everything is full of robots and you can kind of control them or hack them or whatever anyway warden scout titus keep your voice down hmm. Thorp has eyes and ears all over restless shores does he now i'm the last warden scout left the others let their guard down Thorp found them and where is he so i can find him instead oh five more i'm glad you're here jonas says you're the best among us Mm -hmm. Makes me feel like I at least have a fighting chance if the corrupted close in. Okay, so <laughs> everyone else is dead. <laughs> we are on Eterna. Dead or worse. Hmm. Thorpe's corrupted took them. They, they were torturing them. The screaming only stopped this morning. The plan now is to retreat. Mm -hmm. New plan. I'm going in. Oh, what? Oh, what's that? You're going in there? You're in. No army? No, nothing? Uh... This madness. I can see you're not changing your mind. Jonas said you were stubborn. Suit yourself then. Go. Ooh I guess I'll stay and cover your escape. Does that work if you want to do this on your own? Or is this a golden steel, whatever? Healer, da da da, last gen. Into the depths. Enter the depths expedition and confront uh, Commander Thor. I mean. Oh, Greenborn! Don't I know this guy? Wait, Rusnix? Uh, this other dude, Sinov Sloth? I know those names. I've played with them before. They're not the ones who were looking for group, though. I think they just helped out. Groupborn was the dude I uh, went into Amlin first. That was pretty neat. Let's just take this camp for us. There we go. Right. Do I have another one of those uh, tokens, though? Wait a minute. <laughs> okay, so uh, you get additional mission items every time. That's pretty neat. Let's just uh, open all of those boxes and see what we get. Uh, a little bit of corruption stuff. And... Oh, that one is good. With a critical chance. Pretty nice. Let's um, get rid of that. Uh... Also, this one, what am I going to do with the axe? Light and heavy attacks do more damage. This might be decent. If someone wants to use it for a dex build. I don't know if this is a... If it's a mixed... Nah, it's not a mixed one. It's a pure strength scaler. Like, there are some that have a mixed one. Like, the spear is mixed. Uh, the hatchet is mixed. And the, uh, the sword is mixed. Then the pure ones are up here, like Great Axe and Warhammer, the heavier ones, of course. And then there's a pure dexterity one for the bow. And the... yeah, only the bow. Musket and Rapier are, are dex and intelligence scalers. And then there's a pure intelligence scaling on the ice gauntlet and fire stuff. A split one for the void gauntlet. And then a pure life stuff scaling. Interesting. So, it looks like I uh, have to call out and look for a group now in order to go into the depths. Obviously. Or maybe... Can I, can I do this on my own? Because it's a quest-related mission? I don't think so. Oh, Rusnix is in there. No, wait a minute. Weren't these guys the one from before? Yeah, I think they just came out of here. Uh, let's see. Minimum, yeah, you can't open it if you don't have a, a group. Not enough members, that's so iffy. Why can't you just try this on your own? I mean, okay, wait a minute. If you tr would try this on your own, then uh, you would be able to farm uh, like early game items and completely distort the market. So, maybe this is some kind of a situation there, who knows. Uh, did they say anything? Kimra, la, ba, 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 ba. Um, nothing, nothing, nothing. Let's try to, uh, look for someone for depths. Then, um, out of J, the 
Это из... Оба. А... Cut all. There we go. It does not say that. Oh, come on. What's going on with the chat? Um, maybe it's uh, similar to the way the setting system distorts stuff. Maybe I have to do that. Maybe I have to open the... Oh. The map. Like, I can go into area mode and chat order again. Maybe it has something to do with the amount of characters in here. Like, if there are four of them... You can do this, but... Uh, Maybe there's a certain restriction. Once you have shown so many direct messages, uh, the stuff is just gone. But how do you get those people out of your direct message log? That's weird. Whatever. Uh, let's see. That means I have to uh, log in and out again. Exit to main menu. Sure. Damage numbers. If your damage numbers are blue, the enemy has resistances. If they are red, no. You don't do red numbers. You do yellow numbers, if anything. Uh, yeah, what was I? Uh, damage numbers. Uh, only companies can declare war and siege territories to take them over. As governor uh, of a territory, your company earns coin through taxes, gets huge discounts, and so on and so forth. I could really try uh, to go into a one man uh, army situation. Uh, how did plug? So, let's see. Let's try this again. Uh, LFG, Dabbers. Uh, got orb. Not org. Not go orb. G O T uh, O R B. There we go. What's faction doing? Plus for portals. Inverse. Right. H. Right to group. Uh, where's the other guy? Harry de Blanc. There we go. Oh! Everybody can uh, inf anyone else. That's cool. Alright. Right back. Okay. That means I'm gonna cut down a few more trees. Wait, Roos? Yeah, that was the Roos next guy. So. What about this one? Coyote. Or maybe I can do some. Yeah. Why don't we just do some fishing? Let's do some fishing. Da 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 dee da da do. Use a fresh water bay. Da da dee da da do. And. I am. It's all about speed. Decent amount of speed. Speed, 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 speed. Reel it in, and boom. Small try. Did it again. But there's no... Uh, nah, there's no pond or water. There's no hot spot. <laughs> uh, is this other dude waiting for anything? Oh, by the way, waiting. Um, I need to look at the uh, chat. Maybe there's another one who also wants to go into depths, just in case. Oh, and you can get... Fish sort other there as well. Wait a minute. So now I can move this about. No one direct message to message to us. L of uh, M. Two people for devs. Uh, easy run. Uh, Camrows. Some others. There's some area here. Be right back. Da 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 da. Yeah. Let's uh, open up the feed again and only open uh, chat in the group. There we go. Cool. 
And there he went. Good. Man. Wanna buy a gen last healer? DPS spawn. <laughs> They always buy themselves in. Come on. Uh, that's ridiculous. How much is that worth, by the way? Or is it one to buy or one to be? Probably one to buy. And then there's this, like, one to buy last gen. Have experience. I mean... That's a problem about it. Like, how do you get uh, a spot uh, in an expedition if you have to buy your way in, right? So, getting in there is a problem. And then they are probably looking for other people who make it easier uh, to survive there, right? So, you need some experience there first. So, the high level uh, dungeons are then really problematic. I mean, the low level stuff, you just look for other people and you wing it, basically. Um, but the, the more high level it gets, the, the more, like, special, uh, an experience you need to pay. So you can't really get your foot in the door. In this case, what you need to do in order to make that work is, like, uh, yeah, how would you make that? Damn it! Come on, that was so close. Okay, uh, Jen, spots failed. Uh, anyone need to do corruption breaches? I'm on the quest. Uh... I already did a few. But I again just winged it. Oh no. This might be the same fish. And one. And one. And one. Hmm. The difference in tension growth is really interesting. See that? Like sometimes it's fast and sometimes it's not as fast. And it, either it's random or it follows a certain pattern. But it's definitely there to make it more difficult uh, for people who use maybe uh, a clicker for this. But a macro would be so good. <laughs> so you activate fishing, you go take a pee, and then you end up having thousands of experience. That would be pretty neat. Because you actually don't need to do two uh, different things. There are too many different things. You can just uh, hold down a button, right? You click once, and then you just need a certain interval for clicking again. Maybe uh, you can even program a certain randomness factor into the clicking. So, wasn't there another dude coming in just now? There's... What's this one doing? Ah, looks like another quest guy. Right, that means... We have, uh, what about, what about this? There, there, there's some on there. Let's see. Or maybe they're also part of another team or whatnot? No. I should just use the voice chat every now and then. Just to initiate uh, the conversation really quick. Because it does actually take a little while until I write that stuff. <laughs> I mean, I am decently quick. Not that fast. Uh, so no, I don't know how many words per minute I can write. It's definitely not much. Useful, yes. And get some abbreviations, if anything. Uh, Holin Molin. Okay. Holin Molin is what kind of level? Let's see. Where is Holin Molin? Wait a minute. Uh, somewhere completely different. How many kilometers away? Six! Hey ho. Uh, let's just keep on fishing. It's actually a nice way of using the time, this guy is. You need to do anything. Like some, yeah, <laughs> some just cut down trees, some others go mining. Little old gathering. The fact that there's a pond right near is actually quite neat. 
Maybe you can have uh, yourself a little fishing contest. An unofficial expedition fishing contest. <laughs> maybe even fish in an, in an excavation. You just go in there in order to fish. Or maybe you can fish something, uh, some rare items in there. That's cool. Uh, one spot left for depth. Yeah, that's Rusnik's. Let's just uh, let him manage that stuff. I'm going to concentrate on the fish. Uh, once in a lifetime opportunity. Uh huh. <laughs> because. Uh, because, like, there's. Damn it. Uh, let's just evade a little bit. No, I don't want the fresh water. I want that stone. So, wait a minute. What are the other levels? Uh, there's Holy Molin 40, 40, 60. Actually, that's just one, and that's real snakes. The other ones are at the level range that we need. So, uh, let's just uh, keep it fishing. Oh, no, wait, that's not working. Uh, that one. It's R, not E. There we go. Ah, he's a fishing master. Uh, uh, did he actually change his title? Just to mess it a little bit? Okay. Alright, let's get the last one and then we should be ready. Just give me a, give me give me a moment. And give me a moment. And there we go. Right. So that was the fishing master. Uh, wait a minute. Was Nick's was this guy? Um, one, two, three. I'm counting four only. Like looking for members. One spot for depths. All right. Let's keep on fishing. Thought that was at least one more dude already. But this is the thing, like you look at the names on the side, but you don't actually think of your name being part of the group. Because sometimes you have a different uh, different position when it comes to icons. So it's like your icon on the top and then the smaller icon somewhere at the bottom. Okay, all teal mix five cinder commander. Uh does. Kimo meters. It's like a million kilometers. Let's fish some iron out of here. Amazing. Wait. What happened to Rosnix? Or maybe it's just a vlog or something. Let's see. Holy Molin left the group again. Okay. What's going on? Uh, Harry the Black left that. Wait, wait. Uh, Rusenix is this guy. Are you sure you want to uh, to leave the group and join a new group? Uh, yeah. What's going on? So, start it. Right. Depths. At least one person must enter to keep the expedition open. Teleport. Now. How do you teleport into the domain? Join group. How do you teleport uh, into a domain, by the way? Uh, how do you TP into a... Uh, 
Excavation. <laughs> Alright. SF1. Oh, okay. Right. Uh. Do we need... Who's this guy? What are we looking for? Uh... Who sneaks us over there? Okay. Oh! How on earth do you get up there? There we go. How I do despise jump puzzles, really. I mean, Guild Wars, nice and all, but jump puzzles, holy moly. Um. Hmm. Okay, yeah, is, there, is there any other chests around, or did I miss something? Nah, whatever. By the way, where do we go? Did we go through this one? Ah, okay. There's another one of these things here. Steel color. Goes to open that thing. And it stays open. Good. Right. Uh, let's read this afterwards. Alligators. It's the the depths. Uh, where's Rosenix? Over here. No direct messages in here? Alright. Or maybe they are talking in the area chat for now. Oh, that's a strange creature. Ah! Yeah. Really, everybody using their lifestyle. Uh, ah, wait. Uh, let's just get to number three. Wait, wait. Okay. I thought you need multiple life steps in order to trigger that thing. Weird. Um, fight through Commander Thorpe's defenses. Sure. Wait, uh, we came from over here, then we went over there, then there's this thing, uh, another thing, and... Uh, ooh, Rivercrest, yes. Why not? Could be another chest hidden somewhere up here, though. Right. For you, Bernard. So, where's the guy? Oh. Oh, wait, there's another one. Okay, so there are three thingies to read. Ah, 
yes, another chest. Here's yeah, a quest, uh, steel, cull, whatever, cull throb is. do that now because of the usual time that you well that I take fiddling with things <laughs> so let's just uh, focus on fire Small traveler stone. Anything else? Any, any papers or whatever? No. I think we got everything. Uh, wait, there's a. Where's Rusings? Rusings over there. side there? Nope. Everything good. Open sesame. Ah. Like if he uses his uh, our ability, then it immediately shreds wherever enemies there. It goes and dead. So cheap. So cheap. Oh, wait a minute. Ah, let's let them have that. Uh, is there maybe some other stuff in here? I'm looking for the third piece of text. Oh. Oh no, wait a minute. I'm not going to take that one. Let's just let the one with the most damage first. Ow! Okay, so it does throw boulders out. Good to know. But it does end with uh, Thor, doesn't it? So that means... Ooh, there's a hunk of meat. Ah, this is the hunk of meat that we need. And it has a similar design to all of the other excavations. So you end up on a bridge somewhere doing things. Wait, they're just running. Why are they running? What are they doing? Uh, you know what? I think I should use the AOE. Wait, where's Holy Moly? Ah! Just give me a second. There we go. Just a second. Okay. Right. Uh, right there. Okay. 
Okay. Um. How does that work, by the way? That one does not work. That's how that works. Ty, someone is pinging things. What are you pinging, by the way? Also, is there more things to read? No. Okay. Ooh, that looks cool. Ah, wait a minute. You cannot go beneath it. Not as easily. So where are the others? Somewhere down there. Get into the healing circle. Ah, oh, flamethrower. That's perfect. I want to see that. I want to see only flames. This other dude was as safe as a fireman. Uh, what are we trying to trigger here? Oh, that's... Wait a minute. There's more. Okay. Stand in here where there will be no issue whatsoever. Yeah. Nah, you know what? Come on. A few too many. Unbelievable. Somehow the enemies just disappear every now and then. It's so weird. Right. Uh, there's no text here. And on this other side. Is there text? Is there text? Nope. I'm a healer. I'm helping. <laughs> uh. What the? Okay. Okay. Wait a minute. Is the other healer doing the same build as me? Looks like it. That's also seems makes sense, right? There's no other void uh void scaling. There's no other focus scaling weapon. Alrighty, there we have another orb, corrupted shrine. Wait, that's not working. There are multiple teleporters, though. What is it? Do we have to... No, not destroy it. Where do we go? Stay inside the sanctuary, please. Stay in here. Rusnix, Rusnix, Rusnix. There's the guy. Can we deactivate that? I actually thought this was some kind of turret. Right. Wait a minute. Do they drop stuff? No. Nope. Da da dee da da. Defeat scary acolyte uh, of the depths. Wait, there are a few more. So it only goes down from here, I think. Do we could just go around and so cool? Uh-huh. 
Okay. Maybe there are a few more of those acolytes, but I think there are. We missed something. How many are we? Uh, I'm counting five. One, two, three, four. A lot. There we go. Right. Who wanted that? Oh, hey. Who was that? Who's throwing arrows? And I definitely need to choose a button that unlocks things. Okay, wait a minute. How many more enemies are there? There's nothing in here. Good. Uh, this enemy is just throwing shade. Uh, nothing there. Uh, there's a little bit of stuff right here. to restore the seal. Wait a minute. Hmm. Again, uh, you basically go down the domain, and then you go around the circle, and then the stuff happens. Interesting. So it is a similar layout. Not the same, but similar. Right. But in a way, there's no either you go left or you go right. It's just that, uh... What? Get killed. I still need one more of those acolytes, though. Anyway, I want to finish my thought, at least. So it only goes forward, basically. Uh, but because of the layout of the level itself, you would think uh, as if there are, like, four roads and so on. Which is actually a very nice way of making that. Like, it looks more, more advanced than it actually is. Pretty sweet. Oh, yes. Let's get the earth crack. Uh, there we go. Was that more? Nah. Let's wait. Good, 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 good. Can we really stand in each other's way? Yes. Sometimes you can just walk right through another, but not here. Oh, wait. Arc, you can, uh, as a Mila. Wait, let's, um, stand right where the healing is. Oh, come on, that one takes ages. Yeah, just a few more seconds and I'm good. Oh, wait. We need to destroy this stuff. No, oh, not again. Ah! What is going on? Okay, wait. Uh, oh, okay. That's how that works.
Ah, damn it, that's another one. That's also another one. Uh, do you destroy that stuff, or do you need to interact with that? to use the Azov stuff against us. Alright, let's check about that. Uh, one of the bosses. Done. Uh, where's Thorpe? Rejected sacrifice. Sweet, sweet. But we're not done yet. I uh, didn't get anything. <laughs> uh... Sweet. And onwards. Ah, there's something more to read. Let's pick this up. The box. Now we got that one done. But, uh. Was that it? No. It still goes on, doesn't it? It has multiple layers. Oh, Thorpe's key! Ah. Ah. I was wondering where that dude went. Wait a minute, someone pinged. For platinum veins, yes. Oh, that one takes a while. Uh, not good. Uh, not good. Uh, come on, do it faster, do it faster, do it faster, do it faster. Ah! Why do people ping platinum veins? Why are there platinum veins in here? They're so distracting. Oh, come on, just two more hits and we're good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. There we go. Right, uh, they went this way. What is that? That one looks strange. Maybe in the future I should definitely craft potions that increase my mana regeneration. Just so I can... Well, spam stuff. What do we have here? Wait a minute. Do we need to go through the same territory a second time? No. It might be that this is like a like a like a skyscraper, just downwards. No that. What else is there? Ah, nice. I see loot, and loot is good. Alright, wait. Uh, someone else, some other stuff. What was that? And we're just, uh, I think we're going through here. Right. Oh, Kibald. The, oh no, a bear. We stand. We will stand clear of that abomination. Don't like fighting bears. Decent damage, though. Decent damage. That one should give you. Oh, I th I think it's gonna be. Mm. <laughs> it's already gotten turned into stuff. Oh yes, some crack. Uh, is anyone else taking that? It's mine now. Woof. Woof. Uh, what do we have here? Destroy whatever. Okay, now it's really dark. I don't see anything. Uh, what do we do here? So that's the way to go. All right. Um, but what about the other side? Do we even? Okay, this is the way around. Ah, okay. Do we need multiples? Uh, 
Okay. Away. Right. Uh, yeah, let's go there. Let's see. Ah, loot! Why is there always loot at the most unforeseen places? I thought that this is how the whole thing continues and not just some side chamber. They like, really need to know that there's a chest over there and a chest over there and a chest over there to maximize your loot runs. And you kind of forget that uh, because everybody's so speedily and just charging through. Thank goodness there are people looking backwards sometimes. Ah, uh, and more locked chest. Okay, that one is locked. That one needs a... Oh, okay. Now, I know the island's secret. Now, I know true uh, Keep me alive, boys. Done and done. You cannot possibly challenge us now. Steal more AOE damage, come on, I need more here. Have to shred the thing. Oh, wait a minute. Uh... This will be the last. Oh, come on. Ooh, I think we should get there a little bit further away. Prepare to have your soul Alright, uh, where's the guy with the least health bar? There. Time to taste corrupted steel! Help. There we go. Prepare to have your soul crushed. All right, I think we almost got it. Just a few more hits. There may not be another stage for this guy. No, there we go. Not Again. Uh, yeah, I think he's good. Right. Party. <laughs> this is so weird. Right. Uh, is there? Oh. Oh, yeah, wait a minute. We need to get the chest. Uh... Sweet. Let's just see. I might have gotten a decent amount of finished missions. Uh, Holy Pledge Ban. What's this? Pristine wound. Hmm. I, on the other hand, just get some random stuff. Battle mage. Uh, no. But it looks neat. Uh, so you do get the uh, good looking things. Only from expeditions. Very interesting. So, anyone uh, want Dynasty? Uh, <laughs> uh, where is that? Uh,. Uh, I'm small. Holy moly. Uh, where is that? All <laughs> uh, uh, right. Uh. Uh, maybe I could survive a little bit. Nah. It's, it's, uh, Hmm. Let's just get out of there right now. Minesweeper. Mm-hmm. 
So, now that we have destroyed Thorpe, mm, we need to manage the corruption. And it was asking, where is that? Not... What kind of bloody level is that? Um, Dynasty, on the other hand. Uh, Holy Modern Left Group? Sure. Do I know where Dynasty is? And they say it's a 55 mission. That means it has to be either in Reekwater uh, or Abin Reach. But I have no idea where that might be. Um... Oh, yes. A bit more meat for Neku Manesh with a hearty snap of his jaws. Neku Manesh eats up all the meat you gave him like he'd been starving. Did you just get a little bigger? Oh, that would be cool. The more often you make that, right, <laughs> the more uh, it gets. Okay, the alligator snaps at you, clearly offended by the insinuation that he isn't big enough. And you can basically redo this mission over and over and over again. Perfect. Um... So, wait a minute. Uh, that was, oh, I don't want to get into that thing. I just want to hit escape here. So let's unpin that. And uh, what other missions have I finished? Uh, ah, yeah, wait a minute. This mission uh, right here. Let's not forget to finish that one. Warden's guard, yeah, you. You survived. Mm -hmm. And your eyes, you're not even corrupted. In did you find him? Did you actually defeat Thorpe? Yes, yes, and yes. That's wild. You're stronger than you look. No offense, of course. I suppose if he really was master of the Tempest, that would mean it's over and we won. Right? Nah, probably not. Somehow, I have a sinking feeling that we're not done. In fact, a messenger came with reports of a new corruption surge in Great Cleave. Where is that? Uh, what's going on there? From the sound of things, nothing good. More corrupted, stronger corrupted coming south from the Shattered Mountain. Mm. The Wardens are losing their footing there as well. Okay, then I should go there. Hold on. You're more valuable back at the fort. Jonas sent word that the Alliance parlay was all set. If you Ooh. can get the factions to sign on to the fight, we could get the support we need in Great Cleave and beyond. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Uh, did they write anything again? It's a level 55 dungeon. Blah. I still don't know where it is, though. Oh! So we are the, uh, uh... Are we the purple one? Yes. Can it be that we always change color? Oh, I'm so close to leveling up, though. Uh, no, I want to open the map. So, everybody's going for TPs, but where do they disappear to? Uh, because I have a suspicion that I are going to this uh, tier 55 dum dungeon. But where is that? I don't see the the, the 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 people markers there. You respawn at this. No. Where on earth are they? Where'd they go? Maybe they're no, no, they're not in level four. Ah, somewhere down here. This has nothing to do. West of Ebenbrook. Ah, wait. West of Eben. West of Eben. West of Ebenbrook. This is Eden Grove, and there was something e Ebenscale. Ah. So somewhere over there. I wanted to get in this area, but not yet. All right. Mm. Where are they going? I'm looking for markers, but for some reason I don't see them anywhere. Maybe they try to travel uh, from one of those settlements.
So. Socials, nope. Drift left the group, and so let's say here again. And the thing is, wait a minute, uh, the ones that are still in the group are like 40, 60. Ah, and what? Uh uh, uh uh, uh uh, uh uh. But this is a nice way to leave the group immediately. Mm. So... That was weird. Hmm. Maybe every time you do get experience, you know, there's this sound. And maybe you do get, exp every time you get experience and you are almost about to level up, there's a sound to it. See that? And again, that's like 20 and whatnot and so on and so forth. You do get a decent amount of bonus XP for that. Okay. And maybe reputation. Or maybe every time you gain stuff? No. Weird though. Okay, uh, we need to go back to Fort Alasa, uh, but I still had a few other missions that I could finish. The heal is definitely a little bit misplaced. Anyhow, the way down is also very, very far away. Let's see, any other missions that I could finish though? Only in here. One quest. Uh, uh, Morningdale. Uh, who do I need to talk to? Ah, okay. Paying respects. That was that thing. Mm hmm All of those uh, follow-up missions. Uh, what do we have here? Dr. Drift again. Looking for Dynasty. Mm. They're just TPing all over the place. But the F1 teleport is pretty cool. Uh, it's just that you, for some reason, do not get any notification at least once it says f1 but it immediately disappears and then you don't know what f1 actually does like does it f1 has no no button for it wait a minute uh is f1 a button in here that you can hit f1 accept notification hmm. that's the client notification accept notification um but the notification has to stay there right in order to be accepted. Or maybe there's some kind of a menu where you can read all of the notifications. That would be helpful. But for now, I have no idea how to access stuff like that. I need to know how much stuff is in the storage. Okay. Uh, it's getting a bit much now. Oh, yeah, we are buying water. <laughs> <clears throat> that is a wee bit stupid. So, yeah, let's go down there. Finish a lot of missions and the episode will be finished with Fort Alazar, of course. But I have to get rid of all of that water, because otherwise I won't, I think I won't be able to buy and sell stuff like that. Uh, again. Okay. Quests are done there. Salvaging things doesn't really work now, does it? Oh, wait a minute. No, this uh, the, 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 the dungeon is actually a good one, right? So that means that with a bit of luck, there's an item that I got out of it that might be useful. Let's see. 
thing is I don't I only do them for the missions, not really for the for the gear itself. Because the gear is completely random, uh, and uh, I'm interested in the stuff that I can actually use, right? And then you get stuff like that. Oh, more lifesteal. Again, pretty cool. Uh, almost 8,000 again. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, would I be able to... S how to use item filter? There we go. Item name. Uh, minimum gear score. Uh, for example, 100, uh, and then it says tier 1, okay, example, sword 200, axe t 1, pick minus iron. Oh, that's cool. Uh, I'm looking for tier 5 and 6, actually. T4, okay, let's see, T4. Uh, no, wait a minute, did I write this wrong? Yeah, T4, T4. Um, this is tier 4, this is tier... Yeah, all of them are tier 4. Ah, okay. And I'm looking for... Rare. Uh, okay, let's look for... Rare. That's not working. Okay, why? Why can't I look for rarity? That would be sweet. Um, so we can look for, look for swords and other stuff. Uh, hmm... At least we got some nice bows out of it, but come on. Bind on equip. Okay, that could be sold then. But uh, I don't want all of those buy orders to accumulate, but I only have a few of those. Yeah, I don't really know what to do with the greens, though. They definitely just accumulate. What do I get from salvaging it? One gold or one coin. That's not much. Uh, the uh, dexterity constitution? No. Um, this is intelligence. That's intelligence focus. Let's get rid of that. That is strength. That could be useful. Uh, that's intelligence strength. That could also work. What about this one? Strength dexterity. Uh, dexterity strength. Yes. Kind of. Uh, but to be honest, I only want to have a good scalers in here. So that's not a good scaler. It's definitely not a good scaler. And uh, strength constitution, yeah, hmm. heavy armor, focus, constitution again, no, that helmet stuff gets thrown out, strength, constitution, focus, heavy glove, no, uh, what else, strength, dexterity, mining luck, oh, that could be you, the thing is, I end up having an awful lot of those lucky items, but am I really going to change it in order to mine those items, or am I just going to buy them, right? That's the iffy bit. Um, also, the level requirement might be a bit too high for just a luck uh, mining luck item. Maybe it would be better for those uh, items to be low level, so I can sell them better. Okay, I don't want constitution on those. Intelligence strength is a strange one. Focus Constitution again. Let's throw those out. Focus Pure. Yes. Focus Pure again. Uh, strength Dexterity is a strange mix, though. Mm, focus Constitution. That one can go out as well. Intelligence Strength is a weird one. Uh, let's throw that out. Throw that out. Uh, throw that out. We keep those. What about this thing? Mm, earrings. The one that I have is better than this. Let's throw that uh, bound on pickup. Yeah, I, puck, I, I pucked it up. Uh, intelligence dexterity. Oh, yeah, stuff like this is good for the rapier. Mm. Yes, damage from ranged elemental standard. Te oh, that's PvP thing. That might be really good. Bound on equip. Uh, bind on equip. Bind on equip. Bind on equip. 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 Uh, pick up. Okay, that one can be thrown out. I'm don't use stuff like that. Bound on equip, equip, and equip up again. Right, so that's stuff that I can sell. Mm, what's the other stuff? Uh, so this is pickup, uh, battle mage. What is this ice gauntlet? Mm. I mean, I do have another ice gauntlet somewhere in the inventory, but I don't want to go for intelligence and strength uh, mix like that. As I said, buy and pick up. We don't go for pick up stuff. 
intelligence ice cone that can be sold or kept in the inventory but i could just buy again another one if i wanted to chain fire oh yes that's good but it's a bow hmm bows use dexterity so the scaling might be a bit off uh hmm but it uh, okay it, it is at least blue this is something that we can get rid of but look at how many of these are one two three four five six seven eight nine um in order to really make this work and we need to uh, sell a ton of the stuff that's not so cool whatever and uh, let's talk to tesla real quick look at the warple blade Really? You destroyed your arc deacon, didn't you? There's another blow for righteousness and the good of humanity. Well done, Nanfari. And as promised, here's a reward. And a level up to top that. Perfect. Oh, and of course we got ourselves some respec points. Ba -ba -ba -bum. Even more damage. Glass cannon, here we go. Like our survival hinges upon the resistance is so gained by our armor. To with one of our own. To what do I owe this auspicious meeting? Auspicious. Right. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to interact with the chat now, should I? Actually, I should because I can't put any orders in there. Will I? Would you wait? Ready, you do this. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> uh, ton of gold. Don't even know what I'm gonna do with that. Um. Let's see. I have some aged wood, but I have no order for buying that. I just chopped it. So let's sell that directly. And the, yeah, the water stuff I have to get rid of really quickly before it accumulates. Let's put a sell order on it. Wait a minute, how was it? Mm -hmm. uh, 150, yeah, that's definitely good. But is it better than the one that we have in here? We have to be a bit cheaper than that, sadly. In order to undercut our. Oh, okay. There's an awful lot of undercutting going on here. Awful lot of undercutting. So, uh, coarse leather hasn't reached its uh, right value yet. That one gets sold directly. What else we got? Maybe someone. Nope. There's still no interest in those items, sadly. Yeah, platinum ore. We can get rid of that stuff. The earth mode as well. Okay, what else we got? Uh, some stone. Some fibers as well. Oh, and some star metal. Star metal goes so well. Ah, maybe I can even reach 10,000 at one point. Then I can just buy whatever house there is. Yeah, I can just buy the, the, the 20,000 coin house. <laughs> uh, amazing. So, blueberry. Ah, no. I wanted to keep them. For other crafting shenanigans. Hmm. Right. Uh, I have to throw an awful lot of stuff in the shed now. What about tenon? Let's throw that out. I just hope that this uh, list will not go upwards again or readjust itself because this is something that I don't like. Uh, Halibut viscera. Wait, this is medicinal regions. Oh, okay. No, we keep that. Health potions and things. Fish sword. Nah, no one wants to buy that. But it is sellable. That's pretty neat. Oh, wait a minute. No, it turns into iron if I... Uh, Adjust it. That's a brilliant Jasper. Yes. Ooh. Ah, yes. The prices went up a bit. What's going on? Okay, maybe I should try that. What about 
Someone wants to buy potions. Yes, absolutely. If someone buys those potions, then yes, absolutely. Wait. This order is already completed by other... Ah, oh, okay. That was me, I think. Uh, and it just did not refresh itself. No, wait. Health potions is something that we want to keep. Cheese baits or oyster baits, I think no one really cares about. What else we got? Uh, the bread stuff, some travel rations, satisfying meals. No. I crawl about... Ooh. Glow. Finally, people are interested in the baits. So, wait a minute. Why is it that the, the glowworm bait uh, is something that people are interested in? And then all of a sudden this... Uh, other one here is not so much. That's that's weird. But anyway, uh, it's a way of getting rid of things, and it's also a nice way of getting additional coin. Oh, amazing! Let's throw this out. Come on, let people fish. Let people fish. Set them free. So, what else? Resources. The thing is, uh, I think it's much better. If you go from one tap to the next and uh, try to sell it this way, instead of going from top to bottom in the normal fashion. Oh, wait a minute. I think I can sell uh, a thousand units if I would... Uh, there we go. What about this one? A large piranha. This can be salvaged into fish guts and possibly teeth, which make a useful alchemical region. So yeah, let's salvage that stuff. The also produces uh, the salvage things. Uh, this is a snail bite. Then we got some selvins, obviously, and uh, this stuff, large trout. Uh, this can be salvaged into food uh, with a chance of acquiring fish oil. Yeah, let's just uh, salvage everything. And some iron, some more iron, and some more fish flies. Yes, what's this one? Furniture. Impossible geometry notes. And corrupt talisman. Oh, is it sellable? Yeah. Maybe that one goes for a very large price as well. That would be sweet. That would be sweet. Then, uh, what about my cell order, by the way? Uh, I have 72 active. Uh, I can sell, like, what about armor? The profane boots. Yeah. Sell them for 10. What about the comparison? Yeah. Ah. Yeah, we're gonna sell them like that. Uh, throw them out. Be happy. Get maybe free gold. The main problem is uh, it may not be competitive. Like 43. This one. And then you have this stuff here. This is. Just throw it out to kind of be nice, right? That's it. Not there to make any profits. Like in the end, the armor, for some strange reason, uh, will just sink in price more and more and more, because there's a actually until a certain threshold has been reached, um, and the threshold is determined by the income or uh, incoming, let's say, amount of armor into the market, because uh, every 14 days, basically, the armor has to be resold or yeah uh, reordered or whatever and the whole thing has to refresh that's something to keep in mind here so uh what about this one yeah let's uh, don't use these things let's see it's five gold is it yeah so stupid oh wait uh the amount can't be changed but this one can be changed then you would make it a little bit, a little bit of a profit Look at how little that is. Oh, come on. I want to sell it for at least a little bit more. It's a... I think this is the same thing. Defiled Ice Gauntlet of the Scholar. Defiled Ice Gauntlet... Mm-hmm. 442. Four, ooh, slightly better even. Slightly better. Slightly better. One more damage. Hmm. So, I don't know what I'm actually competing against. Uh, should I sell it for 55? But then it just sits in my inventory all the time, right? But if I don't do this, I don't get a decent amount of coin and I could just salvage it. But if I just throw it out for 5, then bleh. 
Uh, so let's just put a 5 on it. Like 55 is okay. Everybody has at least 55 coin. Um, I don't care if I'm getting undercut or if it gets sold or not. I'm just going to sell it for 55. So let's throw this bow out. Right. Uh, what about the spear? Uh, this is exactly what I mean. Like it's ugh, ridiculous. Oh, actually, wait. 55 for the uh, the blue stuff. Uh, and maybe I can sell the other icons for like uh, other things for 25 or so. Uh, just because they're green. I mean, the price itself has nothing to do with what the market is going for. Ah, oh, look at what I'm competing with. Ew. Okay. But I have to also look at the price, uh, the, the, the level range here. Yeah? But when it comes to that, let's go for 25 again. Come on. Make it simple. Throw it out. Don't even think about it. If it's gone, it's gone. Uh, and if it comes back, I can just salvage it uh, after that. The thing is, I am at maximum repair parts, which is nice. <laughs> it's a nice problem to have, but it's kind of annoying. Um, there we go. Let's see, another twenty-five. Oh, that bow is actually quite nice with the crit chance on it. So and oh yeah, the the musket. I actually wanted to try them uh, some kind of musket build. The problem is it's a ranged weapon. Uh, and I need some, uh, something that would, this is 55, <sighs> that would balance my ranged heal, uh, with the lifestyle a little bit. So, 88, so another 12 orders. Uh, getting any more buy orders in there would be a bit iffy. Uh, 88, wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, uh, 95. Let's see. And this one goes for... Yeah, the green stuff will always go for uh, for 20 now. Uh, yeah, half the level-ish, right? Uh, so... The level divided by 2 divided by 10. Modular. <laughs> so there's no... There's nothing like that. Uh, in this case... This thing here is like 44. So it ends up with... Uh, Oh, that's actually quite nice. Uh, but yeah, we're going for, for this much. For two in front of it. Uh, and actually, yeah, I checked all of the items and none of them were in any way interesting. So this will be 15, 25. Yeah, the level range is like 44, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40. Yeah. So I'm going to sell them for something 20-ish. Uh, what kind of strange price that is. Come on, do it already. There we go. The thing is, we don't want to make no profit. Uh, come on. So, perfect. Now most of this stuff is done, and I can still fry another five units. What about the the time though? It still doesn't sort correctly. Like it goes down uh, four days, and then all of a sudden, there's a certain change uh, happening here. Like there's the new things. Something is wrong with the way it's sorted. That's so weird. Something is wrong. Maybe. I think I know what's going on. Um, the items are on two different databases. And it takes uh, the information from one database. And fuses it together with another database. But the sorting uh, algorithm that happens. Uh, that's supposed to do all of this. Happens uh, before the the database uh, gets gets uh, gets fused. Or what, what's the bound together? No. Uh, combined. Let's call it combined. There's probably another word for it. But the sorting alg uh, algorithm happens before the database gets uh, combined together. 
two of the database get combined together and this is why you end up with the assortment here and in this case what happens is uh, this thing triggers a a sorting algorithm in all of the databases that gets that get fused into this one here i think otherwise i cannot really explain why it starts twice uh, at a high value right that's just really weird and then the whole thing might have been uh, id bound also so there's database one and there, there's database two and it starts with listing everything in database one and uh, then everything in database two and because the sorting happens only on the databases themselves, this stuff happens. The other way would be that the uh, D variable in here uh, is like lower and uppercase or something like that. But that is definitely not the problem. But this is so weird. This, 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 these are strange problems. Um, problems that only exist uh, if you try to like supersize the whole thing. <laughs> Okay, what about thick height? Uh, we want to get rid of that stuff, of course. And what else do we want to sell? Some fire, fire, yeah, fire modes. Why not? Let's get rid of that stuff. Don't think I have a buy order on that. Um, what else? Oh, strong guys, Sure. There was another dude who. <sighs> oh damn it! I still have a buy order on those. Ooh 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 ooh. <laughs> I have a buy order for. Yeah, wait a minute. Uh, I can get rid of this buy order right now and let's just this guy have a little bit of fun. But if I, as long as I have this buy order out, then I can basically push his buy order up, right? Because otherwise he would adjust it, go down a little bit. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. So sweet. So every time I uh, craft strong Alkahest right now, I have a this prize that I can get. The problem is, I can only make this work with his op that I have uh, accumulated out on about in the field and not crafted. Yeah, out about in the field and not bought in the uh, the trading post. So, where was I? Um, I wanted to do a little bit of crafting then. Uh, I mean. How does it go? Okay, basically doubles, but. There don't really seem to be that many of those. Anyway, we got some poultry, some other stuff. What else could we get rid of? Molten lodestone, maybe. And then look at this. If sometimes you do this and the list gets readjusted. And sometimes it does do that and the list does not get readjusted. So weird. All right, wait a minute. Didn't I get a decent amount of iron? Yeah, I did. So why hasn't it reached 1000 yet? Weird. Weird, weird, weird. But anyway, uh, let's get rid um, before anything bad happens. So sell all of this, of course, for yay much. And the ingots themselves as well for again. Yay much. Okay, what about the gold? How much is coming in? Available 1000. Hmm. The thing is, I don't want it to accumulate too much. Okay, the amount's actually quite nice. Oh, except for. Oh, no, you don't. Um. There we go. Much better. <laughs> uh, much, much better. I have a slight suspicion that I'm actually competing with myself. And, 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 and there's some iron, there's some gold for 188. That's the newest one. Nope, I'm not. Right. What am I going to do with the lumber? No, the lumber can accumulate. Like, this stuff is... Uh, used more frequently, I would say. And what about this curaculated things? The dried blood of a powerful foe. 
You need it for something, I know, but I do not know for what. What about buy orders? How do they go for? Slightly different prices. Uh, but if I want to craft this stuff, then I can definitely utilize it. In this case, would it be better to just sell it this way? I mean, it's just one gold. What about its weight? Uh, 6.3. No, uh, right now I think it's actually gotten a bit too heavy. Let's just throw this out. We don't need that. And gold is trickling in. One point, whatever, five coin. What's no, this is the stuff that we just got from the sale here. Now <laughs> it's at 9,000. <laughs> That's so funny. Mm. What else could I sell here? I think there's nothing else. Yeah. Nothing else that could be used. Maybe I can use the uh, the buying function for the leather and maybe do some tannin things. That could work. Feather. No one wants feather. No one wants reeds. No one wants LP. Wait a minute. Found in caves. What am I usually using this for? I don't have any idea. I have not even the slightest clue. Wait, another 50 gold. Ah! Some items are getting sold. The ones that I put in there for uh, 55 coin each. That's actually quite nice. What else we got in here? Uh, corrupt talisman. Corrupt talisman written in an unknown runic language. Yada yada yada. And let's throw that out. And other people have a little bit of fun with crafting. So, anything else? Fungal slimes? Nah. This stuff? Oh. Ah, uh, someone. Ah, uh -huh. okay. So it's still in my inventory. I couldn't really sell it. Not good. Calculated blood again. Wait. Oh, I think I know what happened. I just satisfied the whole buy order. Then there's some stuff that's left. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Right. Uh, but wait a minute. I do have a few more of those gems. Uh, maybe I should sort them a little bit so I can see them all the time. Uh, let's go into resources. Uh, all items. No. Uh... My sellable items, yes, but then you can't really sort them differently, which is a bit iffy. Um, gems, resources, uh, wait a minute. Resources, raw resources, and uncut gems, raw gems, there we go. There. I just want to have a way of sorting this a little bit better. Because it's just uh, one and two units of gems all the time, I would say. What do we have here? Yeah, brilliant sapphire. Let's throw that out. I mean, it definitely is not just worth 50, but uh, definitely has a much better use if I sell it to another dude than by just not getting used at all and sitting in my inventory for an eternity. And whoever is buying this for like 50 coin right now might be out of their mind. I'm their sole supplier of gemstones. <laughs> uh, Alright. Oh, pristine moonstone. That might be... Ah, there we go. When it comes to the good stuff, the price is actually more normal-ish. So... Alright, what about... What else? Flawed diamond? Nope. That only goes for 0.15. What I actually uh, want to see in here is some kind of like automatic selling system at least. So you can uh, maybe put all of the kinds of items that you want to sell into a list. Uh, and then you can activate and deactivate the selling list. Bef or maybe you get the... Um, yeah, every time you interact with a trading post, you get a little notification telling you, do you want to activate trading uh, list and in inspect the list? And if you say yes, then the whole stuff gets automatically sold and you don't even need to do a single thing. That would be amazing. Oh, it would make things so much easier. All right. Uh, shared corrupted matter. Nope. 
Uh, ba -ba 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 I am looking for another gemstone because I know there is another one somewhere in here. I just have to find it. What am I going to do with the silver? Uh, let's just throw that out. Right. Uh, where is there some flint? Yeah, let's get rid of that too. So, somewhere up here. Red meat? No. It wasn't red meat part of a mission that you can do, I think so. Wow. Onyx. Onyx is worth a lot. Onyx and diamonds, I would say. That's amazing. Holy shit. Everything's like 50 cent, whatever. No one cares about elemental uh, damage types or so on. But when it comes to resistances, some uh, some mixed resistances, some... Uh, or maybe... What was Onyx doing? Uh, Onyx, Onyx, Onyx. Either it was some resistance thing, uh, or it gave you additional damage. And it was a very easy thing to proc. This is why it's all so cool. So let's throw that out too. Don't need that. Then what else? What else? What else? What else? Uh, there's some honey. There's some other stuff. There's some pine cap. I think I pretty much went through all of that right now. Okay. Nice. What am I going to do with the life mines? I mean, I wanted to do some crafting just to get better at it altogether. But if you really think about it, the highest amounts of money uh, I only get by buying and selling. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm scalping. Uh, right, let's see. Can't be that many more items in here. I just want to empty all of my pockets. Put it all in here. Wait. Buy and pick up. Mm. Uh, that's a cool one. So we're going to salvage it and get rid of that. Then, potions. Let's get rid of potions. This is something that I want to keep. What about that thing? Health and mana. I mean, I have 40 potions right now. They do weigh a little bit, but nah, not, not yet. Okay, let's keep the bait. And the furniture goes away as well. And the chemical thingies too. The tannin things as well. The special stuff as well. So much Azov. Um, hmm. I think that's pretty much it. 120 still, 400. I have to do something about the silkweed. I mean, at one point, I could just uh, collect it all and put it in one large cell order. Instead of waiting for other people to put out demands. Right. Um, I wanted to do some cooking. Let's see. Oh, Dr. Rift again in the Dynasty. Always in the Dynasty, they're doing it. The sausage, what am I going to do with the sausage? We need this and yeah, let's turn every tier. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Every tier one item can be turned into a sausage. The thing is, I don't have any more tier one items. The other way would be to make some seasoning here with the honey uh, and oregano blend. Uh, but that's pretty much it now. Oh, maybe there are other... There we go. Like that one. Multiples. Seven. Yes. What does it do? Uh, it increases intelligence by ten for so and so many minutes. Nice. What, what about focus though? What is... Intelligence food? Focus food. There we go. It's uh, something in the middle, I think. Uh, six focus, no, focus, 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 fo pure focus, by 10, 25 minutes, yes. And there's only one recipe, the venison rot roast, which is, uh, not as easy to come by, you have, like, one thing that you can get from, uh, from enemies, and the other stuff can only be obtained from, okay, maybe some herb plants, but there's some specific stuff, and containers, mostly containers, though. And this is the same. You have some raw foods, kitchen. Where do you get bread? 
Oh, you have to make them yourself. Sure. Wait a minute. Why is this one intelligence and... Ah, this is a mixed thing. There we go. Yeah, let's just, let's just make all of those. Maybe sell them. Maybe someone else has a need for buff food. I don't. I just draw out the fight until the enemy just doesn't want it to fight anymore. Um, yeah, sausages, bloody sausages. This is already a tier two thing. It makes no sense. All right. Um, we are going to craft all of those. And then I have to go for another tier 2 food. Yeah, it doesn't matter what I'm going to go for. Oh, wait. No, this is level. XP. Ah, okay. So those two. Good. Uh, tier 2 of these. Uh, tier 1 of those. Yes. Then we're going for some some eggs, some milk, some honey, some mushrooms. Yeah, let's go for mushrooms. So now that we got the sausages gone, I can go do the fillet. The problem with that though is that it gets kind of iffy uh, to level up. Okay, we got some nut and some oil. Let's do this once. Then maybe some butter. Even more sausages. And this is the thing, you have high tier quality stuff, but making sausage is only good if you want to turn some tier 1 stuff into tier 2 stuff. Ugh. Okay, let's make another blend. What about these things? Oh, okay. Now I know why. Uh, what am I going to do with this? Bigger fish. Hmm. Uh, it's just a nice way of getting additional... Additional experience, but nothing more. That's the thing that annoys me the most. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah, the table resources are the same. You can't even put a tier 2 resource in here. Because otherwise it would have been too easy. Uh, Alright. What am I going to do with those food items? It says that I have them. I just accumulate. And at one point I just have to take all of that and just throw it out. <laughs> that is... Uh, yeah, they're only good at dye making. Oh, wait, by the way, dye making. Uh, how do you how do you go into the dye menu? Uh, unlock change skin. Uh, there would be some... How would you use the dye menu? I mean, there's a store kind of hidden there, but... Uh, dye, da, 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 dye, dye, dye. Ah, there we go, dye. You can only do it over here. There's no dye function on the weapons. Would have been cool, though. So, uh, let's see, die. Ah, so there's a die window, a s separate one. You can just uh, get in here from different means. But let's see. Uh, let's look for die. It's a consumable thing. Uh, dies, magenta. I am interested in yellow, purple. It's always a specific color. Can't I just go for some? Yeah, gray. Uh, frozen basalt. How much is that? 60. <laughs> Are you mental? Wait a minute, this is the only one, isn't it? <laughs> uh, wait. Oh no, I have a buy order. Ooh, ho, 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 ho. Um, buy one now. And refresh the page. Yeah, you can refresh this page here, but you cannot refresh the other one. There we go. Place a sell order for 100. <laughs> uh, actually, no. Let's go for 150. Right. 
So, what else we got? Some murky water. Actually, I want to get the ones, uh, the dice with the cheapest prices so I can uh, try something out. There's Viridian green stuff. There's Tranquil. Uh, Tranquil, Viridian. Let's go for this Tranquil stuff. I uh, got all of them. Let's see. So we got some greens. And now I need uh, some other stuff to contrast it a little bit. Um, I could try some orange, uh, but that, nah, I want a mineral green dye. That could work. How many are there? Seven. Um, mineral green. Yeah, let's try that. Okay, let's see. Uh... Ah, confirm uses a double. Ah, uh, what about that one? Using this on the metal doesn't do anything. Also, I have deactivated the helmet at every point, right? So that means no dice on the helmet. Mm. That one is fairly colorful. I thought this stuff wouldn't work as well. Let's see. basically camouflage armor. Okay, we're gonna go for the uh, colorful thing here, and... Whoa, the whole armor. Actually, it looks better this way. Right, uh, what about that part? The gloves, sure. Uh, I would have to say that the black gloves look best, because of the contrast that they give. Ah, it's the band. All right. No. The bands can be a certain accent color that we keep. So this color here and this color here can be the same. Uh, what about that one, though? I'm just looking at whatever changes. Ah, it was the head part. Yeah, that stuff has to be something vibrant. So that one comes up here and comes up here. Um, this stuff, on the other hand... No... Uh, what's the color that changes right now? I have no clue. Could be on the... Hmm. Ah, and the tint. Oh, that's cool. But no, we're going to keep that tint. What about the trousers? There we go. It needs to be different from this screen here. Then... Nothing there. Okay, that spot here we're gonna keep. No, that's not working. Okay, what about that part? Ah, there we go. That looks good. And uh, the fur is actually part of the rest of it, so I'm not going to tint that. Okay. Oh, right click is rotating the camera. Uh huh. Wait a minute, so what's this one doing? That one changed the metal? What about the one before that? Hmm. Alright, let's confirm that. Not as many tins used, uh, but at least we have some kind of style. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. And I was at 10,000, and now I'm not anymore. <laughs> kind of helped myself for it. Right. Uh, yeah, what about the timber stuff? I'm not going to get any more timber, because someone is overcharging a lot. What about the profit? Profit is good. Uh, so let's readjust the lumber. Not timber, lumber. Mm. Uh, no, wait a minute. I can just set another lumber price and then I'm gonna get rid of the previous one here. So let's put a buy order of 0.61 uh, and 5,000 as usual. Bam. Right. Um, buy orders for this thing. 2,000. God. Uh, so much money sunk in here. 
But thank goodness you can adjust it on the fly. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. I wanted to get rid of this. Didn't I? There's so much going to accumulate. Nah, yeah. Let's, let's, let's just get rid of this. Let's just get rid of this. Let's get rid of it. Get rid of it. Let other people have some fun for it. Bam. Good. Same goes for the reeds. I mean, someone probably wants to craft that stuff. We won't make a profit, but we supply the market with stuff that it does not need. <laughs> Um, like this, this is basically like we want to reduce our cost, right? In this case, it's a cost of utilizing our storage. This is some things that companies do, uh, if they throw or trash, um, or maybe if they have stuff that accumulates that they want to throw away, and uh, throwing away things and uh, means that someone has to take care of that. And then it costs again. So what you want is to lower that cost. So in order to lower that, it would be more interesting for this company uh, to maybe even uh, give these items away for free because then people are just taking them away and there's no additional cost on that, right? This is basically what recycling can be. Uh, but again, uh, this item is not supposed to be used uh, in this manner and then it probably ends up competing with another uh, object so let's say i would uh, how could i do this yeah let's say i'm f um, selling lumber right um and some of the wood i give out for free then the people will probably buy that and make some other stuff out of wood uh, but then they're not going to buy the uh, higher quality, normal wood that would not have been wasted. So it kind of eats up uh, your own profit in this way. So it gets rid of the uh, of the of the of the cost of the trash cost, um, and it also kind of lowers your own profit. So you have to balance this one out. In this case, you need a decent amount of numbers in order to figure out if that makes sense or not. Which is again really weird. Uh, right, so this one gets off a lot of stuff. Peter, we don't need that. And I think I'm good now. And I actually wanted to make something with the blueberries, but for some reason the... the, 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 the ah, because it's a tier 3 thing. Hmm. Because it's different. Wait a minute. I have a buy order for linen. Why is that one not working? Uh, linen. Uh, that's why. Someone is undercutting me right now. That's me. So that means I'm going to shove that a little bit higher. Uh, buy order for 5,000 linen. Um, there. But the thing is, it's only 82, right? And at that moment, it will actually turn into my buy order. So I think I don't really need to adjust it too much. Actually, let's let, let's let it run its course and see what happens. Uh, lumber is already adjusted. What about the leather? Yeah, leather. Uh, leather. 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 Mm, uh, that one is already maxed out. Okay, then what else we got? <laughs> Water. That's a funny thing. Uh, iron ingots, yes. Iron ingots and gold. Gold uh, ingots. They're on the top there. Then there's silver. And I'm looking for ingots. Precious. Normal ingots, please. There we go. Iron. Also on the top. Perfect. Then, bulrush cop, uh, 0.24, I uh, got a decent amount, but I think someone else is charging a bit more, or paying a bit more, bulrush, uh, bulrush cop, yes, uh, right, so I have to adjust that a little bit, buy it for 0.2, actually, what about the difference in orders, 0.26, yes, possible so let's up that a little bit and five 
thousand go. That one. Too bad you can't cancel your own orders in this one. It would be so sweet. And cancel that. Get the one thousand coin back. Oh. Wait a minute. This is uh, will be returned to you. The remaining. Wait a minute. Yeah, this this is how much uh, I think it cost once you put it in there, right? Uh, but the calculation of the actual value happens once you take it out. That's why, because now I just gained uh, nine hundred of it, but some stuff was already bought, and this is why there it wasn't one thousand two hundred coin, and just a little bit less. So as I said, bull rush cup. Can I buy maybe something else? What is something good? Uh. Coarse leather. What else do we have? We got some linen, we got some lumber. Oh, timber, sure. Uh, let's see, let's buy an awful lot of wood. Um, timber is some in between thing that should do it. Noise. And what about the difference? 0 0.18 and 15. Yes. There we go. Ah, oh, nice, 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 nice. Yeah, we're gonna do that. So, let's go for 5,000 of those. Uh, and maybe 0.9 over here. Nice. Place buy order. What else do we want to buy? We got some timbers. Ba, 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 ba. And ingots. Maybe I can go into the mode selling again. I just have to figure out which mode is the best. Um, so we're going into resources and magical resources, actually. Right? Craft, Arcana. Yeah, that's the one. Let's see. Def Quintus. No. Uh, let's see. Life mode. 0.61. Whoa! Equilibrium price. We can forget about that. Um, what about wisps? Are they actually getting bought or sold? Maximum number of orders already created. Oh, you got to be kidding me. I can place this. That's weird. I can do this for uh, for this order here. But I can't do this for the other one. Okay, I'm, I'm mixed out now. Because all of this stuff in here is garbage. Okay, let's just let it be. I got a thousand I can play with uh, around with this uh, once I start recording at another day. I mean, it would it would be much better if I just utilize all of the money, right? <laughs> That's how we really do that. Utilize everything. Don't keep it in your inventory and not let it uh, get, get you any profits. That's not what we want. Anyway, uh, let's quickly go to Weaver's Fen and finish uh, another one of those missions. I want to get rid of those green markers. Ay, 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 ay. Place the furniture decorations in your house carefully to gain points in the decoration score. Right, where do we need to go? It's probably a board mission, isn't it? Uh, yes. Um, no wait, Pia. So convoluted, and uh, they are buying water. Water, I say. Water! <laughs> uh, they're buying water. The and bloody believable. Gathered are helping me learn a great deal about the they are buying water. <laughs> So, there's just some uh, crafting missions in here. Hey, wait a minute. I can finish some of these. Energized rations. Oh, no, I don't have them on me, do I? Also, not those. Let's cancel this one. Cancel that one. I want to finish things that I have on me, to be honest. Um, Alright. Any other missions that I could maybe finish somewhere? That's a teleport of 100... Oh. Six. Definitely not gonna happen. 
So, and I wanted to finish the... Uh, wait, did I? No, there are no missions in Brightwood finished. And I wanted to finish this episode with Fort Alazar. Let's do that. I did not use up all my coin. I'm so annoyed by it. Really annoyed. Just because I hit the maximum buy order. Ah! Uh, not cool. Ex absolutely not cool. Wait, what's this? Uh, extinguish fires of Road Fort Alazar. Oh, oh. oh, now I know why you need border. And why there's a well. Because I think before it didn't really work. Oi, 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 oi. You know what? Let's just keep the triumphant return as a start for the next episode. Until then, like and subscribe, of course. Ta-ta.